All right, so today we have the unboxing of the Lamott Color Q2X, the home edition. Um, this one is again designed for homeowners. It's by Lamott and it's the digital pool water test kit using uh, photometers. So let's get right in, we'll open it up. It comes neatly packed, really nice box. Keep it dry. And inside we have our tester. We've got our reagents. Um, it's got some safety information. This particular te te kit comes with 20 different uh, reagents and test tabs to do 20 different tests of all of the different parameters. Um, this one tests for free chlorine, total chlorine, bromine, if you're using a bromine pool or spa, pH, alkalinity, calcium hardness, and cyanuric acid. Okay, and using the free chlorine and total chlorine, you can use that to determine your combined chlorines. So again, this is what it looks like, how it comes packaged. Okay, you've got all your tubes over here. And it's nice and neat with all your caps, different colors, organized. It comes with a cleaning brush inside to clean out the tubes. Um, and yeah, so that's it. So within the kit comes these little, these are your reagents. They come in little packs like this and there's 20 of them within this kit and they're easy to identify because on the back of them it's labeled. This is phenol red for pH. Um, the you know calcium hardness, it says it right on there. So again, you get 20 tests for each uh, chemical level you're testing. The directions are really easy for this comes with this really awesome um, handout here that has every single direction for each one. I'm assuming once you do it once or twice, you'll get the hang of it. It seems very simple. It tells you to just fill it to the five milliliter mark and you simply pop in one of the reagents right here. You just kind of pop it through the foil, pop it right in. Whoops, I missed, that's okay. We'll pick it up, put it in there. Um, probably want to so you crush it up um, put the cap on all right right now I have it set for free chlorine so I'm gonna switch it over to pH I've got it on I've got it nice and mixed up phenol red is always the reagent we use all right invert it and put it, it says invert it three times two three we're gonna put this in and i'm guessing we're gonna press the button one more time and it is gonna give us a reading of 7.7 7. okay and this is my filtered water for my fridge i tested that and got 7.7 7. And I'm gonna run a second test with my unfiltered water, and then I'm going to retest them again to see if my results are accurate. Stay tuned. Then I'm simply going to put this in. All right, and I'm gonna press the button. Last one was 7.7, and this one, as you can see, is also 7.7 .7. so that is my filtered water from the refrigerator and I got very similar readings to both so overall I found this product to be very accurate um, I did like fooling around with it and I checked the results with two different other testing uh, kits and also strips and they were right on they were very good um, usability uh, it could be a little easier I would say if I was doing this and using this every day, I would probably take all six of them, fill them up to the correct line, put all my little reagents in, crush them all you know, at the same time, and then test one after the next after the next so you're not constantly having to click through. I think that would be the easiest way, um, but it is packaged well. It's a good, very reliable test. What the highlight of this is, and in my personal opinion, the best part of it is, 
It comes with Bluetooth and it's got the Waterlink Solutions app. So when you get these results, you can send them directly to your iPhone and it'll input them in your phone. It saves all of your results, all of your testing levels. And it also will give you recommendations right off based on your levels as to what you need to put in your pool and how much. And that's a really cool feature that saves you an additional step from some of the other kits where you have to test and then go research or figure out what you need. This app will do it for you. So it sends all the, resi all the results right to your phone. And again, in that app, it's called the Waterlink Solutions app. It's free and it says, your pH is low, you need to add X amount of soda ash to bring it up. And um, again, it saves all of your calculations, it's got all your history in there. So that's a really cool feature of it. Um, I should also mention it's waterproof. Again, anything near a pool, if your product's not waterproof, I, uh, it's not gonna last very long. So this was the Color Q2X, the home edition, um, and brought to you by Lamotte. It's pretty cool, uh, could be a little easier. But uh, overall, pretty cool product. I liked it. Now, this one is the Color Two Color Q Two X Pro Series. Okay, Pro Seven Series. As you see, it's bigger. It comes in this nice little case. Um, and let's open it up. It's a really nice feeling case. It's kind of a hard, durable plastic foam. Okay. Oh, it's nice, nicely packaged. Um, same photometer here, same six tubes, looks like the difference being instead of 20 of each, you get 100 of each of the reagents, same little bottle, um, your caps are up top, it looks like it comes with the brush and the same crushing mechanism, um, it's pretty much looks to be the same exact process as the other ones the only difference is you get a lot more of the tests and they're individually packaged and it comes in this really nifty carrying case which is waterproof as well this one also this one also connects to the app has the same um, app features via bluetooth and it's also waterproof um, but it tests for the same stuff just a bigger more heavy duty kit and more reagents. So overall, I think that this is a good test kit. Um, both of them were good. They were very accurate, and in comparison, they were right on with my other testing kits. Um, my honest opinion was that the they could be a little bit easier to use. Dropping the reagent tablets in, that wasn't difficult, but crushing them up was a little bit harder than I thought it should have been. Um, and again, in hindsight, I would have lined every single one up, put all the different reagents in, crushed them all, and then tested and click, click, click. That would have been easier. But um, when I'm poolside, I, I, you usually don't have a table or some kind of work surface. And I think that you probably need a workstation or, or at least a space to do all of this, to keep all the reagents and the tablets and stuff, everything in order. Um, aside from that, it was pretty cool technology, um, and again, it was very accurate. The highlight of it, however, was the app. As I was fooling around with this app, I started to realize how awesome it is and how, again, I told you, it sends the results right to your phone, and then it tells you what you need to add to your pool. Um, so I started fooling around with it. You can also add three different pools to it. Um, and again, it sends the results via Bluetooth. If you need help with the testing, there's video tutorials on here. You select what test and what kit you're doing and a video will pop up and show you exactly what to do. I thought that was a really cool feature. Um, they also have this feature where you can use these test strips. Um, these are the instant test strips they sent me. This one does the three-way, which is the free chlorine, the alkaline, and the pH, if you want a, just a quick idea. This one's the four-way, so it does the same thing, and also cyanuric acid. You can take the app and take a picture of your test strip and it will take those results and put it in here and give you an idea of what you need to add to your pool. Thought that was really cool. 
Um, there's also all kinds of different help settings in here and you can enter you know, your volume of your pool, it saves your history and all that. So that was a really cool feature. But again, um, as far as ease of use, I would say there are easier tests out there. Um, I would have to use this over a longer period of time to get an idea of if I could get used to it. Um, but overall, not bad. Um, I think it's really cutting edge technology using the photometer to measure it. Um, so all in all, pretty good stuff. Thanks.